age of 12 or 13, I saw the movie Snatch, which was the Diamond Heist movie by Guy Ritchie. And that was my first rated R movie. And I saw that and I was like, wow, that is so fun and silly and ridiculous. I don't know movies could be like that. And uh, combining that with the fact that my brothers had kind of done their own you know, filmmaking, uh, I thought like, oh, that seems like fun. I should, I should try that. bunch of us that were about the same age, which was really great. Um, but it did get to the point where, where it was hard to link up with them, so then I started just using my nephew, who I eventually just started casting as all of the characters. And doing that, my friends saw again that, like, oh, those are really cool, we want to be a part of that. And I was able to use that as leverage to be like, oh, I can make you look really cool on screen, you know, you get to get in gunfights and stuff. You can kind of nowadays teach yourself how to shoot a movie or you know, edit online, but you can't teach yourself how to talk to actors or talk to designers or how to create a director's concept and you know, get all the departments together and kind of figure out your design and how it's going to work together. And I started studying theater at UAA and that was a huge door opener for me because then I realized, oh, there's so many people that do something that's super similar. It's the same kind of usage of creative talent. It's just a different application. And I was able to find a ton of actors and designers and people like that. But it was still hard to find filmmakers. And like I met Quentin Stanky, who has shot the last three films, or four films we've done. There's always tons of things. We're learning every shoot. A lot of things were always like, man, if we'd only known that, or could have done that better, we would have. And just meeting new collaborators that can do those things better than you can is always great. To kind of know your strengths and know your weaknesses and then find people to help you cover down where you can't pull the slack. That's kind of the philosophy I've tried to hold is like, I want to be a professional so I'm gonna act like it even though I'm just doing this for fun right now really. But. I'm just gonna leave an awkward pause here for a second while I collect myself.